Hi everyone, my name is King Ivy and this is Introduction to Python. Uh, this is our sixth lesson, so if you haven't seen the previous five, I recommend that you check those out. So I have increased the font size just to make it a little bit easier to see. And today we'll be covering if statements. So if statements are essentially a Boolean logic. And if you've used Excel in, in any extensive manner, you've programmed in any other programming language, uh, whether it's for data analysis or for programming, uh, then you'll be familiar with this. But it's important to understand the nuances that's related to Python. So what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be creating a program. And the program is going to be called uh, car rental assessment pretty simple program okay so let's go ahead and get started here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna ask for a few inputs and the way we ask for an input is to use this input prompt and then we're gonna you put inside there the prompt that you want to show the user what is your name so the question you want to ask and then we're gonna ask for an age and we're gonna input it and say how old are you? And next we're gonna do some if statement logic. So here we're gonna go if, in this case, because uh, age is gonna be captured as a string, uh, we have to put int around it just to convert it from a string to a number. And we're gonna say if it's greater than 65, then, then is denoted with colon. We're going to print their name. And then we're going to print this statement to them. Congrats, you qualify for a senior discount. Perfect. That's all we have to do. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to put another condition on it. Uh, first, it's going to run through the first condition. If that's not met, it's going to go on to the next one. And we're going to use LF, which is the same thing as else if. And then again, we're going to do int here. And we're going to go greater than 24. And because it runs through the first logic first, that this one is a greater than 65, it's basically between 25 and 65. We're going to print. And we're going to say name plus congrats you can rent from us and then the last one is we're gonna go int age oh, sorry uh, we're gonna print a message to them we're gonna say name plus unfortunately you are too young we're gonna say please come back in and then we're going to do a quick calculation here. Uh, and we're going to say, come back in. Uh, we are going to go, first I need to get the age, which is int, age, convert that to a number. And we're going to go 25 minus, and then I'm just going to put this whole thing back into a string. Perfect. And then we'll go ahead and run that. It's going to ask us for a name. So we're going to say King. Ask us for an age. Let's test all six categories out. We'll say 66. King, congrats. You qualify for a senior discount. Okay, perfect. That looks great. Let's run it again. Let's call it King. And let's say 30. Congrats. King, congrats. You can rent from us. Okay, perfect. That sounds great. And let's go through the last scenario, which is king. And then we'll put 16. King, unfortunately, you are too young. Please come back in nine, uh, I should have said, years at the end, plus years. And then we'll run that again. 16. There we go. So now we've created a full fledged mini program in Python using if statements. So if you have any questions or comments in the comment section, feel free to leave it in the comment section below. And if you thought this video was helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I look forward to speaking to you next time. Thank you.